What's going on YouTube? It's your boy WTF back at you guys with another video. Alright, today we're going to talk about the top 10 strongest Pokemon in Pokemon Go. Very excited to uh, share this video with you guys. Gen 3 is officially being rolled out with ghost type Pokemon during this Halloween event. I thought this would be a great time to share with you guys the top 10 strongest Pokemon in Pokemon Go. Now, a couple disclaimers here right off the bat for you guys is we're not going to be including legendary Pokemon in this video. I will be looking at making another video that will have exclusively all the legendary Pokemon from Gen 3 with the top 10 strongest Gen 3 legendary Pokemon. So in this video, there's going to be no legendaries. This is the top 10 strongest Pokemon in Pokemon Go, excluding legendaries. All right, so before we get started, if you guys are new to the channel make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and make sure you guys put the notification bell on um, I do tons of videos on Pokemon Go and I'm all about sharing with you guys all my thoughts everything in regards to the game any hints etc alright so uh, getting right into it I do use the website rankedboost.com they do an amazing job with keeping up with all the latest information on Pokemon Go uh, so that's where I was able to get pictures and move sets and so forth on all these Pokemon. So as you guys can see at the top of this, rankedboost.com is a great site. So if you guys want, check them out. Alright, so getting right into this. Alright, so top 10 strongest Pokemon in Pokemon Go. Number 10 is Agron. Agron is a steel and rock type Pokemon with a max CP of 2286. Its attack is 110, defense is 180, stamina is 140. Agron, that's one sweet looking Pokemon by the way. Agron evolves from Aeron with 25 candies to Larion with 100 candies, then that evolves into Agron. Agron's quick move is Bullet Punch, Rock Smash, Metal Claw. Charge moves are Flash Cannon, Ancient Power, Gyro Ball, and Rock Blast. This once again is a rock and steel type Pokemon with a max CP of 2286. Alright, number 9 is going to be Gardevoir. Gardevoir is a psychic and fairy type Pokemon with a max CP of 2341. Attack is 65, defense is 65, and stamina is 136. So this is going to be a great Pokemon to add to the collection. I'm just not sure how useful it's going to be because of the attack and defense being a little lower. Um, but another great one to add to the collection and at number 9 on our list here. Alright, so this has this evolves from Ralts, which evolves into Carlia, and that evolves into Gardevoir. And there is going to be another final evolution for Gardevoir. So that's going to be pretty sweet. The final evolution is going to take a Dawnstone, and that's going to be coming out in a later version of Pokemon Go, which is going to be in Gen 4, and that is going to be Gallade. As you guys can see right there, Gallade has a max CP of 2341. Alright, so now in regards to the movesets for Gardevoir, Gardevoir's quick move is Confusion and Psychic Cut, and its charge moves are going to be Future Sight. Dazzling Gleam, Psychic, and Disarming Voice. So as you guys can tell, there's going to be some new moves coming out with Gen 3, and hopefully they'll release abilities. We'll see, but that definitely will change the game um, and make a lot of Pokemon that weren't as good uh, and make them a lot better in the game. Alright, so that's number 9. Going right into it, number 8 is going to be Spectile. Spectile has a max CP of 2380 with an attack of 85, defense of 65, and stamina of 140. Spectile is a grass type Pokemon. Its pre evolutions are Trico, which evolves into Grovile, which evolves into Spectile. Spectile is the final evolution with a max CP once again of 2380. Its quick move is going to be Bullet Seed, Razor Leaf, Wine Whip. Its charge moves are going to be Leaf Blade, Petal, Blizzard, Mega Drain, and Power Whip. So once again, this is a Grass-type Pokemon. Alright, number 7 
is going to be Flygon. Flygon has a max CP of 2458 with an attack of 100, defense of 80, stamina of 160. Flygon is a ground and dragon type Pokemon. So just so you guys know, Gen 3, there's a lot of dragon type Pokemon that are coming out in Gen 3. Some are legendaries and some are not legendaries. It is one of my favorite generations because of all the dragon types. I know everybody loves dragon types. I love dragon types as well. Um, so this is definitely one of my favorite uh, generations in Pokemon series. Alright, and the pre-evolutions for Flygon are Trampinch, which evolves into Vibrava, which evolves into Flygon. Once again, Flygon's max CP is 2458. Its quick moves are Mud Shot, Dragon Breath, Mud Slap. Its charge moves are Bulldoze, Dragon Claw, Drill Run, and Dragon Pulse. So, a couple of uh, new moves as well coming out. But that is number 7 on our list. Alright, going to number 6. Number 6 on our list is gonna be Militic. This is one pretty looking Pokemon. Um, and as they say here as well, it is said to be the most beautiful of all the Pokemon. So Militech is going to be another sweet Pokemon to add to the collection. Militech is a water type Pokemon. Its max CP is 2542, its attack is 60, defense is 79, and stamina is 190. Militech does have a pre-evolution, which is Fubas. Fubas evolves into Militech with 50 candies, and it does take Pris Prism Scale as a stone to evolve. But its max CP once again is 2542, and it is a water type Pokemon, with a quick move of Bubble and Water Gun, and a charge move of Aqua Tail, Scald, and Water Pulse. Alright, so that is number 6 on our list. Alright, going into number 5 is Blaziken. Blaziken is one of my favorite Pokemons in Pokemon Go, guys, and I do know a lot of players love this Pokemon. But this is my favorite fire and fighting type Pokemon in the game. And Blaziken is one of the starter Pokemons as well. Uh, with a max CP of 2858. With an attack of 120. Defense of 70. And stamina of 160. Blaziken has pre-evolutions. Evolves from Torchic. Which evolves with 25 candies into Cumbusen. Which evolves into Blaziken. Blaziken's quick moves are Ember, Counter, Fire Fang. Charge moves are Fire Blast, Brick Break, Fire Punch, and Close Combat. So this is number 5 on our list, guys. Very excited for this Pokemon because this Pokemon is going to be really, really sweet in the game. Alright, so getting right into number 4 is Swampert. Swampert is a water and ground type Pokemon with a max CP of 2967 with an attack of 110, defense of 90, and stamina of 200. Alright, and Swampert has pre evolutions Mud Hip evolves into Marsh Top, which evolves into Swampert. Swampert once again, it's a water and ground type Pokemon with a max CP of 2967. Its quick moves are Bubble, Mud Shot, Water Gun. Charge moves are Aqua Jet, Bone Club, Scald, and Bulldoze. Once again, this is going to be another sweet Pokemon to add to the list for water and ground type Pokemon with a max CP reaching right around 3000. So this is going to be a really nice one to add to the collection. It's going to be right around 3000. Alright, coming in at number 3 is Metagross. Very excited for this Pokemon. This is one of my favorite Pokemon in the game, in all of the generations. This Pokemon is going to be awesome. I, I just love the look of this Pokemon, and it's a Steel and Psychic combination. So this is going to be one heck of a sweet Pokemon. And the max CP on Metagross, look at this guys, it's reaching... 3377. So the max CP is going to be 3377 with an attack of 135, defense of 130, and stamina of 160. It is pretty balanced out of all of those, so that is pretty sweet. Metagross has pre-evolutions. It evolves from Beldum, 
which evolves into Metatang, which evolves into Metagross. All right, its quick moves are Iron Tail, Extra Sensory, Metal Claw, Charge moves are Flash Cannon, Mirror Coat, Gyro Ball, and Psychic. Very excited for Metagross. Can't wait to add this to the collection. I am totally going to be catching a lot of these because I want to get a 100% IV one. So this is going to be one heck of a sweet Pokemon to have in the game. And I'm sure it's going to be a good Pokemon to have as, you, as far as uh, a battle team goes. Alright, coming in at number two is Salamence. Salamence is one heck of a colorful and nice looking Pokemon in the game. Salamence has a max CP of 3484 with an attack of 135, defense of 80, and stamina of 190. Now Salamence is a dragon and flying type Pokemon. It does have pre-evolutions as well. It evolves from Begon with 25 candies into Shelgon, and then with 100 candies into Salamence. Salamence quick move is Dragon Breath, Air Slash, Dragon Tail. Its charge moves are Dragon Claw, Aerial Ace, Dragon Pulse, and Air Cutter. Very excited for this Pokemon. I love Dragon type Pokemon in the game, so totally excited for this. All right, and if you guys haven't guessed it, number one on our list, drum roll, is Slacking. Slacking is a normal type Pokemon with a max CP of 4,372. Now, more than likely, this is going to be nerfed by Niantic because I don't think they're going to let Slacking slide and be stronger than Mewtwo. So Slacking is more than likely going to be nerfed, but until then, the max CP for this Pokemon is 4,372. This Pokemon is going to compete extremely well with Snorlax. And given all the max CP and attack defense stamina on this Pokemon, I think it's going to probably be Snorlax, but it's going to compete with Snorlax as a normal type Pokemon. Um, because this is one lazy Pokemon and so was Snorlax. Uh, but max CP is, once again, 4,372 with an attack of 160, defense of 100, and look at the stamina of 300. It does have pre-evolutions, evolves from Slay Coat with 25 candies, evolves into Vigoroth, which evolves into Slacking. Max CP, again, is 4,372, that's one heck of a powerful Pokemon, with a quick move of Hidden Power, Quick Attack, Transform, and a charge move of Hyper Beam, one of my favorite moves in the game. Vice Grip, Struggle, and Wrap. Hopefully you guys like the video. Hopefully you guys like the top 10 Gen 3 Pokemon, st strongest Pokemon coming out for Gen 3 in the game. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. Make sure you guys hit that like button. Hopefully you guys like the video. And that's going to be it for today, guys. Thank you again for watching. You guys have a great day. Until next time, guys.